Hi guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can mine Dogecoin on your M1 or Intel Mac. I'm not suggesting that you should do this, I'm just going to show you how to do it in case you want to experiment with mining or get your hands on some Doge without having to buy it through an exchange. First you'll need a wallet, so that you have somewhere to store the Doge coins that you mine. For this video I'm going to be using the Coinomi wallet. Coinomi can be used to store multiple different cryptocurrencies including Doge. There's a desktop client available for macOS and there are also versions for Windows, iOS and Android. On the Coinomi website click on the download button to bring you to the download page. Then scroll down until you see the version for macOS. Click on download and Safari will ask if you want to allow downloads from coinomi.com. Click allow and the file should be saved to your downloads folder. Open your downloads folder and double click the Coinomi wallet DMG file to mount it. Then you can drag the icon into your applications folder. Due to Big Sur's security settings the first time you run Coinomi, you'll see a message saying that it can't be opened because Apple can't check it for malicious code. To bypass this click OK, then open System Preferences and choose Security and Privacy. At the bottom, where it says Coinomi Wallet was blocked from use, click Open anyway and then click Open. Coinomi Wallet should then run. The first time you run Coinomi, you'll need to create a wallet. So on the first screen, click the button labelled Create a New Wallet. On the next page you'll be given a 25 word recovery phrase. You need to write these words down carefully on a piece of paper in the same order they appear on the screen and keep it somewhere safe. If you ever forget these words you'll no longer have access to your crypto. Once you've written the words down click on next and you'll be asked to verify your recovery phrase. Click each of the words one by one in the same order you wrote them down and then click next. Then you'll be asked to set a password. This will be the password you use to protect your wallet in everyday use. Choose a password of at least 10 characters and type it into both boxes. Then click on next. On the next page you can select which coins you want to use with the wallet. Coinomi supports multiple cryptocurrencies but for the purposes of this video I'm just going to be selecting Doge. You can always add more coins later if you need to. After clicking next again you get to the terms of service. Read through them and then click accept. And that's it your wallet has been created and you're ready to start sending or receiving doge coins. Now we need a program to do the actual mining. For this I'm going to be using the M1 native version of XM Rig. Go to the XMRig GitHub page which I'll link down in the video description, scroll down until you see the version for macOS ARM64 or macOS X64 if you're on an Intel Mac and click the link to download it. Once it's downloaded, open your downloads folder and double click the XMRig tar file to decompress it. Then drag the entire folder from downloads into your applications folder. Next you need to find a pool to mine with. For this I'm going to be using unminable.com. Doge is usually mined using the script algorithm, but unminable lets you mine using the random X algorithm and automatically converts your earnings and pays out in Doge or any other coin you choose. On the unminable.com website scroll down the list of cryptos until you find Dogecoin. Click on the Dogecoin icon and then on the next page click random X under algorithms at the top. Now we need to configure XMRig to mine to the unminable.com pool and tell the pool that we want to be paid in Dogecoins. XMRig's configuration is stored in a file called config.json. It's just a standard text file so you can open it up in TextEdit. Once it's open, scroll down and look for the section headed Pools. There are a few things here that we need to change. First where it says Algo, I'm going to change it to rx forward slash zero. Next the URL and port number need to be changed to rx.unminable.com colon 3333. So I'm just going to copy that from the unminable web page and paste it into the text file replacing what's there. Under that you'll see the line for user. 
we need to tell on Mineable that we want to be paid out in Doge. So delete the text that says your wallet address and replace it with Doge in uppercase followed by a colon. Next you need to put your wallet address. Open the Coinomi wallet, select Doge and then click on the button labelled Receive at the top. A window will pop up with your wallet address. Click on the clipboard icon to copy the wallet address and then switch back to the text file and press Command and V to paste it immediately after the colon. Then type a period and choose a name for your worker. I'm just going to call mine MBA for MacBook Air. Now you can just save the text file and close text edit. Now it's time to start mining and begin earning some Doge coins. The first time you run XM Rig, you'll see a message from macOS saying that it can't be opened because it's from an unidentified developer. To bypass this, click on OK, then open System Preferences and choose Security and Privacy. At the bottom where it says XM Rig was blocked from use, click Open anyway and then click Open. A terminal window should open, XM Rig will connect to the unminable.com pool and start mining. If it doesn't, double check that there aren't any mistakes in the config file, especially missing speech marks or commas. Finally, I'll show you how to get paid. Back on the unminable.com website, paste your doge address into the box on the right and click the magnifying glass icon. This will bring up your mining stats. At the top in the middle, you'll see how many doge coins you've earned so far. Once you start getting valid shares, this number will slowly go up as you mine. The payout threshold on unminable.com is 30 doge. So once the amount you've earned passes 30, you'll be paid automatically to the wallet address you specified in the config file. So how much will you make? On my M1 MacBook Air, I get about 2180 hashes per second in RandomX. At the time of making this video, that works out to just over one doge a day, or about 30 doge coins a month. This number goes up or down along with the price of doge. A few weeks ago, for example, before the price blew up, I was able to mine about 8 doge coins a day. I hope this video helps if you're looking to mine some doge coins on your Mac. If you have any questions, put them in the comments below, and I'll do my best to answer them. That's it for this video, thanks for watching.